My story is, unfortunately, I was a victim of uh, child abuse crime. Victim Support Scotland supported me in quite a number of ways, actually. They helped me emotionally, so they were there if I needed somebody to talk to. They looked through all the paperwork with me, went over the legal jargon that I just don't understand fully. They were there every step of the way to make sure everything was covered. Almost like a family member, they were there to be supportive in any way that they could possibly help out. My case did go to trial and I did use uh, the witness service. It's a scary thing to have to go and do because not only are you in a room full of people that don't know you and are listening to what you're saying, but you're also having to kind of face up to the person who did the things that they did. And, and, and that's quite a harrowing experience, uh, especially if you're young. But again, victim support was there to help me through that, even when it was getting emotionally too much for me. They really gave me a support that you don't really expect. You kind of just expect someone to show up, be there as a representative and then go away again. But even after the court stuff, they were always there for the af aftermath of all of that, which was helpful. It's helped me kind of see that I am worth people's time because before it all, I just didn't think I was worth anything and they, they've definitely helped improve that. When I was in the darkest place that I had, thinking that I had no one that I could go to, thinking that I had no one that I could talk to about it or, or make myself have any self-worth, it was victim support that actually made me see the light at the end of, of the tunnel. They showed me that it doesn't matter what happened to me, I didn't deserve what happened and I could bring the person to justice for what they did. And I couldn't have done that without their support. I felt weak before I went to them. And now I feel stronger than ever. What I love most about working for victim support is helping people during that vulnerable moment, whether it be after a crime or at court, it really is rewarding to see them build themselves back up. You feel very privileged to be involved in that good change that happens for somebody to make their life just a bit better. My name is Kate Wallace and I am the Chief Executive of Victim Support Scotland. Victim Support Scotland is an organisation covering the whole of Scotland and we provide practical and emotional support to people who have been affected by crime. The impact that victim support has on individual lives is huge. These families um, are often at a point where they can't begin to imagine where they're going to start to cope with what's happened to them. So very often the challenges that victims face are the impact of the crime on them themselves and how they can get some kind of life back afterwards, but also in terms of um, navigating the criminal justice system, which is hugely complicated and not geared up for victims really at all. Victims of crime react in loads of different ways. Very often people are thrown into a situation that they've never ever experienced before through absolutely no fault of their own. So very often people are shocked and traumatised at the beginning and feel as though they are not really taking things in or not really understanding what's been said to them. So from our point of view at Victim Support Scotland we take a very person focused approach because we understand that the impacts on people can be completely different. Victim Support Scotland, for example, last year, on over 50,000 occasions, we provided support to people either within the court or within the community. That translated into over 30,000 occasions that we supported people within court. So that's witnesses who need help to give evidence, who want to come and visit the court building beforehand, or who may need someone to sit with them while they're giving evidence. And in the community, we supported over 20,000 um, of those affected by crime last year. We've been doing a lot of work in Victim Support Scotland over the last year to improve our services, particularly digital services. And one of the things that we've done is completely overhauled our website. So we've got a brand new website now, which is much more user friendly, much easier to navigate and has information broken down into bite sized chunks. We have a helpline that's open from eight in the morning to late at night, Monday to Friday. And that's now a free phone number as well. We've introduced web chat where you can just be on our website and a chat box will pop up and it's a real person behind that who will help and support you for as long as you need. 
Most people say that they want to have confidence in a justice system in Scotland, that it is fair and robust. And they also want to help because they want to make sure that what happened to them, in terms of their experiences of being as traumatised by the criminal justice system as sometimes they were by the, the crime itself, doesn't happen to anyone else. The most rewarding part about my job is when someone comes through the door and they're really, really anxious and really affected by what's happened to them. And after spending a bit of time with them, they, they can rebuild their life. Absolutely, our key aim is to make sure that people feel as though they're not alone and that the feelings that they have are normal. What we are trying to do is to help victims to recognise that there's a life beyond what they've experienced and to help see how other um, victims and their families um, have managed to get their lives back.